Essentially what we're trying to do is help the utilities tell their asset management story. Hi, I'm Walter Graff. I'm the Program Director for the Strategic Asset Management Challenge here at WORF. Uh, I just want to give you an update on what we're doing in the challenge right now. We use the core concept model of SIMPLE, which you may be familiar with, is where we have the five core questions of asset management along with the ten steps. The five core questions are what is the current state of my assets, what is my required level of service, which assets are critical to sustain performance, what is my best operation maintenance and CIP investment strategy, and how am I going to fund this and what is my plan to do so. I'd like to talk a little bit about our latest uh, guidance, which is a practitioner's guide to economic decision making. This is a pretty groundbreaking piece of research work is conducting here. We want to encourage a way of thinking about asset investments and interventions on an economic aspect. So we want to show how the economic analysis and the underlying concepts inform asset management decision making. Uh, there's a range of issues to consider, especially regarding risk and analysis of cost and benefits of different options and then also the risk costs of those benefits as well. We're going to work on identifying the end of the economic life, which is defined as when the asset is physically able to provide a service, but ceases to be the lowest cost alternative to satisfy a particular level of service, because there's end of life, physical end of life, which a lot of people consider. There's also capacity service level, and now we're going to look at the economic end. There's three parts of this guidance. The background and key concepts are part one. Practical guidance, strategies, and application tactics form part two, and in part three will be case studies. We also have a cooperative agreement for the Environmental Protection Agency. We have one water ID, which is a condition assessment rehabilitation knowledge base. We have an optimization of lift station performance for energy reduction and greenhouse gas emissions. This is, again, trying to coordinate your SCADA systems and your lift stations to get the pumping working in a manner in which you're minimizing electricity use. Uh, we have a flood grouting for infiltration reduction on private side sewers is where not only do we have an innovative technology, but we also have a strong business case presented as a basis for selecting this technology. To sum up, we have uh, our simple knowledge base, which we last summer redesigned to have two, two steps a level one and level two, which is called introductory and practitioner's level. Introductory level is free to everyone, while the practitioner level contains all of the WORF tools and is for subscribers and people who subscribe to SIMPLE only.